What's up, guys? Welcome back to Bag T Golf. New year, new kind of content. This year, we're going to be trying out some green screen stuff, maybe some reaction type videos. This kind of video is me playing about six and a half holes because my phone ran out of storage. And this is just me providing an extra little inside information of what I was thinking on the shot, what I was trying to do, and yeah, just stuff like that. But yeah, let me know if you like this kind of video. And uh, yeah, I might do some more of them. So let's get into it. Let's get into the video. Hole one here, downhill par four. A little short par four to start, but it's extremely downhill. Nice little step through wedge from about 110, 115. About 20 feet left. No need to go after that one. First hole, all I was trying to do, get the speed down. Pretty good putt, actually. Not bad. But tapping fours are never bad to start the day off with. Hole two, par five. Tried to hoist it over that tree on the right because I don't hit it very high. Ended up miss hitting the driver. Put me in the bunker here. And probably the worst swing all day. Feet weren't settled. I had tried to hit like five iron over that lip. Wasn't a great lie. Just wasn't a good idea in total. This one from about 190, as you can see, started about 30 yards left of where I was aiming or trying to aim. And went further left into the hazard. So we got about a 60, 70 yard little, little shot here. Tried to couple hop and stop. Pretty good. Pin high. And we got Richie Rich here from about 25, 30 feet, starting the day off with a bomb. Yes, sir. Richie talking shit to the boys. Love it. Shout out, Rich. Really wanted to make this one downhill, breaking a little left. Just didn't give it enough. Pretty disappointed with that six on a par five. So sitting one over. Par three here. I'm at 170-something, as you can see here. Just came right out of that. Weak and short left. So, bunker. Hit a pretty good bunker shot. It's about six feet here. Pretty good recovery. Not bad. And I really needed to make that one. And I did. So, one over two, two, three here. And I don't know what it is with hole four, but I'm never in the fairway. Every time I play this hole, I'm right where I'm at. So, about 115, 120 here. To a pretty straight on look, just kind of short, didn't just kind of came out dead. Kind of thought it was kind of jump a little bit, but it obviously didn't hit a really good putt here. I thought I'd made it, but obviously catching lips. Hole five here, punching hybrid up the hill, just a short little par four. And we can see Max's amazing camera work right here, watching it in real life instead of through the phone. Shout out, Carter. But hit a good shot here from about 110 yards, about 12 feet or so, right up the hill. Finally get one to go, just so we can make our partner smile like that. A little longer par three here, hole six. I think I hit five iron or something. Miss hit it. Just came up just a little short. You can't see it land. But we did hit a, a decent little chip and run here. Line was kind of off, but pretty good overall. About four and a half, five feet. And we snuck this one in the right side of the hole. So still one over. Playing okay. Hole seven. Just toe slapped the shit out of this one to the right. And this six iron was so good. Just punched it out. Out of the rough there. Not a great lie. But you can see it land just about 10, 15 yards or feet left of the pin. Just didn't get it on the right side of that slope there. But hit a good putt. It looked good for a very long time. And just missed, tap in par. Still, I think we're even now. I don't know. And the last hole of the day. Shout out to the phone running out of storage. But let's show y'all where this one ends up. Oh, yeah. That's what happens when you slide on the downswing instead of turn your upper body. So, yeah. That is the video, guys. Let me know what y'all think. And if y'all like these, we'll keep doing more. See y'all. Peace out.